Hello everyone. Thank you for joining. Today we are going to meet one of our new nominee, Devika Bajaj. I'm waiting for her to come online. And this nominee is very close to my heart because we are going to talk about being in nature and how nature can help us heal and sustain so i can already see devika online i am just going to add her give me a minute Hi Devika. Hi, hi Prachi. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Very well, very well. Thank you. Thank you for joining us. And it's such a pleasure to have you online and live with us. So I, I, I was very uh, happy to uh, see your nomination, right? It's because when we go through a process for our uh, restore awards and uh, the theme for our award and it, it absolutely matched with what you're doing. So before we begin, uh, let me just uh, introduce you to everyone and then I'm going to let you introduce yourself and hear about your journey. So uh, everyone, um, Devika is one of our many nominees and she's doing amazing inspirational work and we want that to be recognized via the Restore Awards. The Restore Awards are our annual awards that recognize the work of selfless healers, medical practitioners, alternative therapists, um, our sustainable products, and so on. So we reached out to Devika after we went through her profile and what caught my attention when I chose uh, Devika and when we put forward her nominees to our jury was that there's only one plant which uh, Devika and Devik Moringa has used, which is the Moringa plant. And I was, to be very honest, uh, attracted towards it or that profile caught my place because Drumsticks are my favorite vegetable, right? So, and then I was just going through it. And I said, okay, let me read what it is about. And when I went through the process and the entire team went through the whole thing, that was really which caught my attention because since sustainability is our theme this year, uh, there's only this one superfood which uh, Devika and the brand talk about and use that in multiple ways. So today I am going to talk uh, with Devika and ask her what inspired her to get into this because uh, she's an engineer by uh, profession uh, right Devika yeah so it, yeah. it was a it was, it was something like drastic I moved from a corporate life <laughs> to uh, alternative therapy and healing people around the world um, uh, Rachana who's been into the corporate life and we moved on so I want to hear from Devika so over to you, Devika. Why don't you give us uh, a peek into your journey? Why did you choose this? Absolutely. Thank you so much, Prachi, first of all. Before I start uh, with uh, the story of how this brand started, I would like to congratulate Rachna Restores and your entire team for doing an amazing job on alternate uh, you know, healing and alternate medicine for lifestyle diseases. It's actually commendable and something close very close to my heart as well. And secondly, I would like to thank you very much for, uh, you know, recognizing and acknowledging the work that we are doing. It gives um, a lot of assurance to us that we are doing something right, you know. <laughs> so <laughs> thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. It means so much. Um, also, well. we also firmly believe in preventive health, immunity and sustainable products. Uh, this is something that uh, you know, our value proposition was uh, when we started and has always been. 
so i will talk about it uh, but yes to introduce myself uh, i am devika bajaj founder of devik moringa and we are into manufacturing uh, you know um, lifestyle and health products all infused with the goodness of moringa which is a powerhouse of essential nutrients and antioxidants so um, you know our ideology is based on farm to table organic produce that is and spread the awareness of use of uh, chemical free and non synthetic elements in our daily lives so my quest with moringa started in 2018 when i was uh, battling with my you know uh, pregnancy weight i was 16 kgs up and uh, i was uh, deficient in d3 b12 calcium um, and you know i was put on supplements by my gynac and i did lose i did manage to lose like uh, a substantial amount of weight under my nutritionist uh, guidance but you know there comes a plateau uh, for everyone Thank you. and at that yeah. time i just happened to read about moringa uh, from two different sources one was a nutritionist from mumbai and second was uh, shishi ravi shankar ji uh, you know he was talking in a video about the benefits of the leaves of the tree so we are all aware about the drumsticks that we generally consume yeah. in sambars and as you said that you have in the form of soup but we are oblivious to the fact that actually this tree is called the miracle tree and every part of this tree is highly highly nutritious and the most nutritious part is the leaf the leaf of the tree which is full of calcium and all the essential vitamins so when i um, you know when i heard and i follow shishi ravi shankar ji so it did make some sense to me and plus there was a nutritionist talking about it to give this uh, powder as a home remedy yeah. to children right so and i am a very very nature driven person i want to take medicines as a last resort uh, you know but and there was convenience factor this tree was in my farm and we used to have drumsticks on a regular basis so i thought why not i mean let's try it out yeah. so yeah. i put my supplements on hold i started consuming the powder made at our own home a uh, very very diligently and just half a teaspoon and in like 4 to 6 months when i again got my blood test done after 6 months there was a miraculous uh, you know uh, it my d3 b12 shot three times the original value my wow. calcium increased there was a compound yeah. called alkaline phosphate which when i mm-hmm. saw my previous all the reports of so many years like for the past 10 years Yeah. it was always low i i do not know what it means but after yeah. these 6 months that alkaline phosphate also came in the range and okay. uh, i lost weight uh, my skin and hair texture improved a lot uh, you know and the most miraculous thing was that my eye power got reduced and you know oh. i got i got my eyes tested at three different places uh to reconfirm the fact because it really mean uh, it really meant a lot to me like you know because i was thinking of getting lasik done uh, a couple oh. of years back but uh-huh. when my eye power reduced i did you know i just reflected that i was doing nothing different in my lifestyle yeah. or in my diet and then i started researching more on this plant that uh, you know how it has been able to uh you know bring about so many changes so then uh in research with some uh, uh, agriculturalist doctors and nutritionists and also doing my own reading uh and then we moved very scientifically we uh, got the produce of our uh, uh farms lab tested and there we could like see that how high it is in calcium and vitamin a which is very good for eyesight vitamin e which is so good for skin and hair uh and d3 b12 so you know i think that was so then also i did not ever think of starting a venture or like doing it um, commercially you know i just started spreading the word amongst my friends and family see how miraculous this is and these are the benefits that i've had so it was then when somebody told me to participate in a local farmers market uh that was being okay. held in my city so i did participate there and so farmers market is actually visited by a lot of conscious people like you know health conscious people who want to go for chemical free products and they want to go a little deeper into what they are consuming right so yeah. they i had a tremendous response 
and then people started giving me wonderful feedbacks on how their health is improving or some pigmentation problem is solved or weight is reduced or uh, immunity is increased in a very yeah. short period of time like you know it was very tangible so then yeah. we figured out that yes uh, something is really uh, working and uh, yeah. moringa powder does exist in the market but there is no awareness like you know there was no awareness uh, exactly. this is something that people want to be educated about in order to try it right so yeah. then we started awareness driven uh, campaigns and a lot of um, education based social media posts and feedbacks you know started yeah. spreading the feedbacks that we were receiving so that's how the community of uh you know our conscious consumers and health experts just kept on increasing organically and i'm glad yeah. that uh, yeah and the amount of satisfaction that it used to bring to me because i always was into a line of business i am a computer yeah. science That's engineer that was my next question was actually that yeah. because it shows you for the health innovator of the year award and i wanted to understand more about because you know you studied engineering and then what was in your mind when you when you wanted to move and start a business because and then we saw your brand so now we we've also nominated the brand you know uh, bevik moringa so both together so your journey as a health innovator and uh, the brand how did you merge it how did you get into this uh, yeah so actually i am a computer science engineer yeah i i didn't tell you did you say something yeah that's what so how did you move from being an engineer to an entrepreneur right because i know while you come from a family of entrepreneurs but uh, this is like a drastic uh, change yes. how did you manage to do that yes yes so um i did my graduation in computer science engineering after which i did mba in finance and marketing um and ever since i've like Uh, before marriage also i was uh, working with my father in his business uh, which is in, which was into textiles then after my marriage i started working with my in-laws in their again like a backward integration uh, cotton ginning machinery and i was very deeply involved mm-hmm. in it but i think some things are just destined prachi um, how i mean how it just started uh i experienced the benefits myself and then i did more research and uh, you know collaborated with nutritionists doctors and agriculturalists and it just the journey just happened and i educated myself uh before okay. starting this but i think it was yeah. passion it was passion yeah. and some things were just destined yeah um also uh, one question like we always say right because we're always looking at natural products and what i found uh, very inspiring uh, with your brand was that it was also working towards making use of sustainable products so even when we are moving into natural things i don't think we need a lot of uh, that because um, you know a lot of people do get quite overwhelmed when we when we say um, being into nature and moving into natural things and we end up just doing a lot of stuff together uh, one point which we also uh, discussed uh, with you earlier also is how did you manage to move into sustainability because when i've seen your website and when i've seen your products you 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 are very much focused on this one um, super food or one plant so i want you to talk a little more about that what prompted you to not move into you know something more and adding to it because your skin care your hair care your supplements are all one product so i want to i want to know a little more about that what prompted you or what keeps you rooted to just this one and yeah Yeah sure a very good question so um i think it all started from the test that we got done and we figured out that yeah. uh, uh you know moringa is actually uh, it's it's a uh, it's it's a whole package it has all the vitamins in fact moringa leaves like uh, moringa leaves are high in calcium and vitamin d3 b12 moringa seeds we got moringa seed oil also tested Uh, so that is very high in vitamin e and oleic acid which is very good for skin and hair care 
then moringa flowers are very good in something else so uh, you know we really felt that and then when we read about it and did, a, did so much research we saw that it has its roots in ayurveda and people just forgot yeah. about it in the process right so ayurveda also had its uh, uh, had the d- benefits of moringa being spread and uh, touted as a superfood now it is uh, being believed in the west that it's superfood but it has uh, its firm roots in ayurveda also in bible it is called the tree of life the seeds have a magical property of purifying the water and uh, i think uh, because all the vitamins are majorly into the single uh, uh, you know tree or a herb i really didn't feel the need to uh, you know go into other products uh, so yeah. and it just kept on happening or uh, happening organically like we started with moringa powder then we felt that some people are not able to consume the powder so they always ask that can we just have some form of capsule or a tablet then you know we uh, try to uh, find collaborations who could make capsules for us and we give them the powder then uh, okay. because it was high in vitamin e i wanted to get like skin care done so we got into moringa seed oil then moringa soaps uh, you know yeah. leaves and seeds being infused in the essential oils so i i think the entire partnering with people just happened uh, in a very organic way you know people yeah. uh, who were making soaps we gave them idea that you know just yeah. infuse uh, the seeds and leaves into you, your essential oils and make so we also believe in minimalism you know these yeah. days people are so much into a lot of different skin care products like for lips there's a different cream for eyes uh there's a different thing for night cream uh, day cream and anti aging uh you know i mean how much can you hold on products and am i am i audible yeah you are i just missed the last line what you said so yeah i just saw that something was frozen on the screen yeah. so what i i was saying was that people don't bother to see the ingredients behind uh different products you know they are just influenced by so much marketing and promotion that is happening and uh, the other brands are doing but we wanted to move in a very conscious way that you know uh, you really don't need to hoard on so many products there there can yeah. be something like aloe vera aloe vera is something which is very good for your skin for your hair and people touch wood are aware of this um, yeah. you know this plant similarly we yeah. had to educate people about moringa so we did like beautiful concoctions of like aloe moringa gel so aloe vera fortified with moringa which is good for skin which is good for your hair which is good for any yeah. kind of uh, skin diseases like eczema or uh, uh, psoriasis or dandruff like you know you don't need to go on searching for products all the time so i think yeah. and similarly for moringa powder because it has all the vitamins in its uh, uh, you know in its belly why do we need yeah. to pop in iron supplement or a calcium supplement or a d3 b12 you know it's really not required if people look into nature is what i feel yeah, yeah. and so yeah and, and also we believe food. like you know uh, health inside out is very very important like Absolutely. if your system is healthy from inside it will reflect on your skin and energy levels outside right so Absolutely. if a person comes to us for acne problem or for pigmentation problem we just don't give them a solution okay just apply moringa oil or something but it has to be balanced well on the you know inside so for that moringa powder or capsules are the best thing because they detox your body they clean your body from inside so yeah it's such an inspiring um, story you know and it's just been 2 to 3 years you said 2018 uh, and very inspiring that these small small things which we tend to get overwhelmed or we miss out i mean i think growing up everybody has seen moringa and drumsticks and we just forget about these small yeah. small things so i am so so uh, happy that uh, you know your brand 
took this and brings out the importance of this uh, wonder plant um, to the entire uh, world. And we are so glad to have you as a part of our awards. Um, like uh, I always uh, say that I am always, always uh, looking for things which are very sustainable and minimalistic. You know, you don't really need to get overwhelmed. So even as a yoga teacher myself, when people do ask me a lot of things about, you know, oh, how do we meditate and do we do this? And I, I'm like, you know, you don't get overwhelmed with a lot of things. So this is, yes. this absolutely resonates with even our entire uh, culture at Rachna Restores. You know, we, we, we are not here to overwhelm you. You need to understand what's good for you and then carry on. Uh, the same with uh, going forward. One question I wanted to ask you because uh, you said uh, kids and I've seen your pictures of, with kids around. What about um, immunity in kids? Uh, can we have Moringa for kids or is it only for adults or what? how does this work? Moringa can be given to kids right from six months of age like when they start their solids. Oh. So you okay. can just put a pinch of Moringa in their, um, uh, whatever they, they are eating, like in their porridge or in their stew or something. And it can be consumed right uh, up to the time that you live. So because oh. it is so full of, uh, it's not a medicine. It's not a, uh, it's a, it's just a dietary supplement. It's a food supplement. It's basically like how we could make the powder out, out of spinach leaves if we dry them or if we make powder out of uh, neem leaves it's just the yeah. uh, you know it's just that and it has no side effects you can just stop it anytime you can start taking it anytime or you can continually have it so um, there is a lot of feedback that we've received from people and uh, I've seen in my uh, kids journey as well so uh, my younger son is uh, four years old and my yeah. uh, daughter is elder to him and he uh, and she is seven and a half so, of course, when my daughter was born, I did not know about it. But this journey started with, uh, you know, my son. So he has been having yeah. since seven months of age. And I see a tremendous, tremendous difference in his immunity as compared to his peers. Or, or like, you know, during monsoons, generally kids fall sick because there is a change in weather. But, uh, yeah, you know, touch wood, their immunity is very high. And we've... Uh, received such feedbacks from people that you know kids who used to fall sick very often or have a cold cough and fever you know they, their immunity has improved a lot so it brings a lot of satisfaction to us why I'm to give them sure. medicines when something natural can really come to their rescue Absolutely. So this was a uh, very inspiring to talk with you about how nature can uh, heal us. And uh, we really don't need to do a lot of things or a lot of, uh, we don't need to get into a lot of herbs as well. So we can just be uh, sustainable. And I remember uh, your uh, words, uh, which says that, if nature can bone us, it can also sustain and care for us, right? So Absolutely. that's so well, uh, well said uh, about your brand. Uh, now, um, just I think there's a question, how often should you give it to kids? Uh, so probably, uh, guys, you can reach out to uh, Devika separately and I'm sure uh, she'll be happy to answer all these uh, questions. Uh, before uh, we wrap up, uh, Devika, I, I want to, again, invite everybody. And I remember we had this conversation where you said that uh, you are also a very community uh, uh, kind of person. Right. So as a nominee, uh, do you have any message for your other fellow um, individuals who are doing such selfless uh, work? And uh, if you, if you want, to, want to give out some message, that would be great. Yes, I would just like to say that uh, the process of, uh, uh, you know, filling out the nomination form has been so easy and seamless. Uh, and I would definitely pass it on to uh, my uh, people, whoever is into like, you know, preventive health or immunity and sustainability, uh, sustainability as your topic of the uh, of the awards is. And because it's so easy, I mean, we really didn't need to uh, work, uh, work a lot or rack our brains into filling the form or giving a video or something. So I would definitely recommend it to uh, my community. 
Thank you so much. And just before we wrap up again, uh, Devika has been nominated for a Health Innovator of the Year award, and her brand, the Divik Moringa, has been nominated under the Sustainable Product uh, category. Before uh, I say thank you uh, to Devika, I would also want to say a big thank you uh, to our sponsors, Savlon India, SRL Care, Organic India, Radio City, uh, Firma India, Derma Fee, Himalaya Waters, uh, the Anna Store and Mao Creations. Thank you our partners for helping us reach out to individuals and brands like uh, Devika and Davik Moringa so that we can showcase the amazing and inspiring work these individuals and brands are doing. Thank you, Devika, again. And we are so proud to have you on our uh, the Restore Awards nominations and a part of our family. And we look forward to having you shine on the stage and length December, 5 p.m. onwards. We are going to be live and we are going to celebrate and congratulate all our winners and hear more inspiring stories. Thank you so much, uh, Prachi, for reaching out to me. And again, like, you know, heartfelt gratitude for acknowledging our work. It was really, really meaningful and meant a lot to me and the brand and the team. And thank you, everyone in the jury. Thank you, so many people who've joined and, you know, they are sparing their time to uh, see this video. Um, many, many thanks to all of you, to the entire uh, community, Rachna Restores. And so thanks to Devika. Thank you once again. Have a wonderful evening. Thank you. So you can just uh, click the cross button so we'll exit the video. And I will just say thank you to all our uh, viewers here. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Thank Have you. a good evening. Thanks. Have a good evening. Thank you, everyone. So that was our nominee, Devika Bajaj. We have nominated her for the Health Innovator uh, Award category and her brand, Daivik Moringa, for the Sustainable Product uh, category. If you know of anyone who is a selfless healer, who has worked awesomely inspiring story in this pandemic, please reach out to us. You'll find the nomination link in our bio and we would love to have you nominate yourself or anyone who you think deserves to be on this platform. Thank you, everyone. Have a wonderful evening and goodbye from Team Rachna Restores and we look forward to seeing you on the awards day. Thank you.